Welcome to another vlog. So we have the carpet guys here installing the carpet uh, for the three bedrooms upstairs. Here I am rocking my Drexel uh, crop top. You can't see that it's crop. You wanna say something? Brandywine proud. We are Penn State. What are you doing? <laughs> I ain't thinking about Drexel. <laughs> yes, Drexel, where is that? Yes, I got my masters there. But anyway, so thank you for tuning in to another vlog. Um, like I said, we have the guys upstairs installing the carpet. I'm going to do this in this vlog. I'm going to show you, reveal what that looks like. Um, and then we're also going to start um, moving some things up in those rooms. So we kind of been holding off because we wanted to wait until the carpet was installed. And, um, and then also in this vlog, we're going to um, do an unpack with me. So I've been getting packages um, before I start, before we actually moved into the home. So definitely want to sit down um, so we can, um, so I can share um, what are the goodies, the goodies that are in the boxes. Um, so stay tuned. So here's a little peek of the carpet getting installed. Uh, this is the one bedroom right when you come up the stairs. So I'll show you what it all looks like when they're done. And then in the other rooms, the other back rooms here. Uh, yes, they are installing, looking good. Don't mind me. It's almost done. So beautiful. Oh, I can't wait to show you guys. Uh, they're doing an amazing job. Uh, so it looks like they got the last, the two rooms in the back just about done. So I'm going to find where the hubby is. I think I heard him. I think I heard him singing and playing music um, as I shared in my first vlog that my husband, excuse the mess, all this have to go out in the recycle. But as I showed you, told you guys in my first vlog, so you guys hear the music, that he is a singer. He's gonna be singing. I'm gonna sneak down there on him. So here is the reveal of the carpet. Uh, so this is Chase's room. 
they finished here. It went all the way through the closet. So this is a gray. Um, I chose something darker. As if you recall, it was something lighter in here. And this uh, carpet is Mohawk brand and it's the Berber. So this is really great carpet. Uh, very good uh, with, deal with high traffic for the kids. Very easy to clean. It's like that really tight knit. Um, expensive, but I just think that with kids, it's worth the money so yep but this is the one room and the padding they changed oh my gosh it feels amazing it's just such a huge difference than what was down here before and then this is the girls room again same same color obviously it goes into their walkout closet and then the other room so I want to show you guys something. So they laid the carpet here, but it's not finished. And it's not finished because as they were laying the carpet, they noticed this defect there. If you see that, um, really close up, there's a defect in there. That should not be. It should look like a clean piece. So uh, the contractor is going to order another piece and replace this one. So unfortunately... <laughs> um we can't use it and for the cost of this and the quality of it i do not want to see this defect in here um it bothers me so yeah so it's not finished he just kind of like stretched it out you know just so it can feel like a room if you will but as you can see in the corner you know it's not finished in there and let me see he probably went throughout yeah so in the closets is not finished so again, this, uh, it's going to get replaced with a different piece without that, that little mark in there. So what y'all think? What y'all think? What you think, honey? I ain't doing a good job. <laughs> y'all like the carpet? Chase? You like the carpet? Yeah! Chloe, she's my biggest supporter. Mm -hmm. Um, unpack some boxes so as you see I have so many boxes here packages um, that has been coming to the house before we actually moved in uh, so I wanted to kind of do an unpack with me and see what we got there's some things from Amazon anthropology um, so yeah just show you the stuff that I that I got in and some of this a lot of it is like things that I'm going to um, the change that I'm going to make in the home, but let's see. So this one, some of this is like partially open, uh, but this is, this is an Amazon package. So let's see what's in here. And I hope my phone doesn't die because it's like 14. Oh, so these are, so if you guys haven't noticed, I'm kind of like my color scheme for my home is going to be warm tones, uh, you know, more conservative colors, you know, like your blacks, your browns, um, you know, your navy blues. And so one of the things I've already shared with you guys that I was looking, I'm looking to change like the hardware on the door um, to black to kind of elevate the aesthetics of, of the home when you come in. Um, so part of that, when you were talking about the doors are these door stoppers. So I ordered these from Amazon. So I didn't want to switch out all the other ones that were put in by the builder. Um, they're silver and these are going to be, they're going to be black. So that's a project for me. And I got a whole box of them from Amazon. Uh, let's see, here's another package from Amazon. Let's see what this is. this is oh so this is uh this is the door handle so I part of again the whole changing the door part hardware on the doors um, this is specifically for the master suite so we're gonna have a digital lock on ours um, where we'll be able to uh, lock it and unlock it um, using a code or a fingerprint um, so this is what this is. So I got this specifically for the master suite. And this one is pretty heavy. 
So here's another, I can't see the box Harden, but another, um, I thought, what it can be. Ooh, I myself with a utility knife. This is another thing from Prime. Well, this is really heavy. I'm not even gonna just leave this right here. I just gotta open it up. This is off the way. As you can see, I still have my gym clothes from the morning. <laughs> I did chest work today and I did not change. It's so hard to open. It looks like it's two boxes. Oh, this is probably, I'm pretty sure this is more hard, hard stuff for the door. Yep. Oh, so these are, these are the hinges. So everything, I'm going black, y'all. The hinges are black, so I'm telling you, if you want to elevate your your space and the aesthetic of your homes, I'm telling you, go with black. Black is just gonna make it modern. Um, but they, this is what this this is what these are. So this is the this is what I'm probably gonna have extra. But when you think about it, what is it like three hinges? So I need I would need three of these per door. Um, so if you're gonna change your rubber blade, you gotta do everything. The door stopper, the hinges, and the knob. So that's what those are, and that is pretty heavy. Um, so I'm not, I just, I'm kinda, it seems like I'm going doing all the door stuff, but I'm just gonna grab a box and just open, so let's see what this is. I think I got this one this week. salads so I wanted a nice bowl and I can't wait to show you my salad service they are in there. and then I also ordered some stuff for my bedding um, so this is so I did um, go with Brooklyn um, I've been hearing a lot of other youtubers talk about it so I figured why not try it um, so I ordered the duvet cover I also got the insert so this is this is like a uh, this is a gray, I guess, like a gray, um, dark gray. So that's that. And then this is this box right here. This is also something from Brooklyn. Um, this is probably the insert. My guess. Oh, and I wanted some sheets too. Actually, got a good deal on them because it was Labor Day and they had a. Um, for the Labor Day special. I would like to see. Oh, look. So, for the amount that I ordered from Brick they did get, I did get this free gift. So, a little tote. This is kind of nice. I will be using that. So, I got some sheets. So, I didn't go with the, the, the I guess they had this bundle um, where you got the pillowcases, the top sheet, the fitted sheet. I did not go with that particular bundle. I actually went with this one that basically included the pillowcases and the fitted sheet. Um, I'm not really a fan of the top sheet, so I was actually kind of glad that they had this. But I got, got it in this um, pattern, the stripe here. And then there are the pillowcases. And then I also got it in the same color. I think it's the same color of my duvet. And then also in here was the insert. So this is, this is, hopefully you can see this. This is the all season down comforter. Um, Cause they had like different comforters on there where they, they were, they were like literally made for like the certain seasons. I'm just like, I'm not dealing with that. I'm not having an insert per season. So I thought this was perfect um, just to get an all season down comforter. It just makes more sense to me. So that's Brooklyn. Oh, 
So I actually just got my mattress. We've got our king size mattress today. And and we went with a brand called uh, Satma. So it seems like a pretty nice one. I can't wait till we get our bed. I ordered our bed from RH. And that, unfortunately, that's not going to be delivered until November. But anyway, but I have all this bedding stuff, right? But Satva, I not only got the mattress, the king size mattress, but I also ordered um, from them their king size pillows. You know the crazy part is, I did not knew they had a thing called king size pillows until my mother mentioned it to me. I just always thought it was standard pillows, and it makes sense if you're gonna have a king size bed, you need king size pillows because the standards would just be too small. So here are. These are memory. Let me put that knife down. But these are the king size pillows. Look, they even feel heavy. But I don't know if you can see this, but they're the graphite memory foam pillow. So hopefully, this one's kind of heavy. That's the king size. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to put this inside. Oh, so remember I pulled out the salad phone? So let me show you. I want this company called Jazz Up, I think. And I've always seen this company and always it always came across my feed, their silverware. And one of that one particular um set that all oh, that just caught my eye. I just thought it was just so excuse me, this luxurious look. But was the um the French style silverware. So they're gold. So these are the solid servers here. And I also bought, so I got this again from a company called Jazz Up. So you can see that. You know now that I'm talking about this, you guys are gonna see this in your feed, right? Um, and then, let me see what this is. Got something else here. So, I think because what I ordered, I got these little things here. This is cute. Also, the gold. Don't ask me what I want to use this for. But I think this was like a free gift. So, you see that. And then, of course, why I actually, what I actually really wanted from them was the silverware. And I have got two. So look, it comes in this nice box. Look at this. You know you get something fancy when they gotta put it in a box, right? And then you got it wrapped in something like this. Like, I just never bought silverware. Or so you know it has to be something, right? So of course it comes with the Oh look, and they saw it in his own individual slot. That's interesting. So here go the forks. This is a fork here. That looks so dainty. That's the fork. I'm gonna put that knife down before I stab myself. Oh, there's another fork. Let me see, is that something? Oh. There's a spoon. Can you imagine eating soup with this? Spoon. And I think, oh, it's just more. Oh, here's the butter knife. So this is actually like, they had different um, styles, but this is particularly the French. The French style silverware. And I guess if you ever go to France, maybe this is what it's gonna look like. But it's the gold. It came in black. Didn't want the black. Um, but that's that. And like I said, I got two of those. Alright. 
Well, well, well. I'll show you what the doorknobs are going to look like. So it's that square. So here's the doorknob. So that's square. So pretty cool, huh? I can't wait to put these on another project. I'm get my husband to do it. So that's what's in these two boxes here. I didn't realize I got, I think I didn't even need all of these, but we'll see. But I think that was it for the doors, the door hardware. And then I think I got some from anthropology. I think this is what's in here. And I'm actually going back into the office. And tomorrow and Tuesday, some more in office days are going to be Tuesdays and Wednesdays. And um, so I'm kind of glad I actually started doing stuff. So I bought, so this is my anthropology. I can't wait to put these on. These are some relax pants. I think they're cute. Uh, so I will be rocking those to work. And then I think these are also some pants. They look huge. What size did I get? Ooh, these are huge. These may be too big. I don't know. They're going to death. Well, no, because these are petite. So, but they look different on the mannequin. But I don't know. I'm going to definitely be rocking those to work because I need. Then I gotta go back into the office. And I think before my phone dies. I think this is the last. No, I got one more thing to show you. Two more things to show you after this. Um, so this, I think I had ordered some shoes. And actually, these shoes will probably go really well with the pants. So I ordered a black, they're flat. And it's by this company. I don't know. I don't know if you ever heard of this company, um, but I have bought two flats. Look, anytime you get like a dust bag for anything, you know you spend money. So I ordered these. These are. Mm, these smell good. They're real leather. They better be the money I paid for these. But these are like the camel color, and then I also got the same ones in black. So you know, I'm gonna do it. you know, I'm sure what the black looks like. Don't touch it. A big up. So these are the black. One thing about flats, sometimes when you get them, they have like that gap. I can't stand that. I'm hoping that these don't get when I walk. Alright, so I'm coming. I think it's almost time to go. But the other thing I wanted to show you that I got. So I got this wreath. It's like an olive wreath that I'm going to be putting on my front door. Got this from Target. Here, let me turn it around. Got this from Target. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to hang it up when I'm waiting on my wreath hanger. I ordered that from Pottery Barn. And um, 
as soon as I get it, I'm gonna hang it. So, yep. These are expensive. I don't just buy. It. I'm not buying. Oh. Turn the camera. I'm not buying a wreath for a season. When I buy my wreath, it's gonna be up all year. Sorry. Oh yeah. And the last thing I wanted to show you, I'm actually going to. Um, I don't know if you can see it. I'm gonna stop the camera. So I had to get up for this one, um, but this was actually tucked away in this corner. But the last thing that I wanted to show you, uh, we did get our TV uh, for our bedroom, and I just got the wall mount um, today, um, the slim wall mount. I'm guessing that's gonna probably make it really flush towards the, um, the wall. And then this little package here is something from Dyson that goes to my Dyson um, vacuum cleaner. Um, so yeah, so this is this is like everything. There's some other stuff that I have bought um, that already unpacked it and it was like something I had to do right away because it was the kids, but I'm just gonna walk over here and show you. Um, so I have bought this, uh, this uh, play table set um, for, the kids so they can have a place to eat on because as you see i don't have my dining table or anything and um even after i get those they're going to be eating on this uh yes but i went i bought it from so that's what these boxes are here that came uh, last saturday um, but it was by a company called lalo um and so yeah they have like really nice sleep stuff like for kids um i bought a high chair um for when Chloe that was um, used last year. Uh, but yeah, this is all my mess. So I gotta clean this all up. And um, and everything I showed you, hopefully you guys will actually see it, see me wearing it. Or wearing the clothes or everything in the house as part of the home decor. You guys will see what that looks like. Hey, so I am getting my refrigerator replaced. If you recall in the last video, right. So if you recall in the last video, um, I put a little blurb on this and it's getting replaced because I felt like um, the refrigerator is like, the doors aren't really right. So the G is here now to come and replace the refrigerators. So let me, Go to the door. They're getting out. Hold on. So G has arrived. So they're coming to replace my refrigerator um, because, like I said, uh, the one that I got didn't seem the doors just seem didn't seem right. They came in and adjusted them, but I don't know something is still off with them. Hello. This is just for my YouTube channel. Yep, so they're getting that ready. Um, I'm gonna close the door here so they get. So they're gonna have to come in and take the refrigerator, take this one out. So let me show y'all what I'm talking about. So if you look at the top there, it just looks like to me is not lined up like it should so like if you see the bottom it looks like it's pushed in more so hopefully this replacement refrigerator would look a lot better um with the doors uh so but it just looks like it's protruding out at the top so um so i already took everything out of it everything is cleared out i just like literally took everything out um yeah so that's out so we'll see we'll see what it looks like um there's all my stuff all on the counter um, so they're doing everything here i'm loading it and there it is they're taking it out the box the same guys that came and delivered the first one. Huh. So from here the doors look better. 
Looks like they're right. The same exact guys, the same three men. <laughs> That's so funny. I think they just like were specifically assigned to this area for deliveries. <laughs> it's part of the state. It's so they definitely know me. <laughs> uh, they're taking all this stuff off and before they bring it in the house. And so I got this paper down because I already know they're not going to put on any booties and take their shoes off. So I put down this paper for them to walk on. So I remember from the last time. So once they get the refrigerator inside, I'll show you what the new one looks like if it meets my expectation. All right, so GE just left and this is so much better. Um, it looks better. It could probably be pushed back a little more, but it definitely looks better. So this is the replacement refrigerator. Um, of course, I can't use the ice maker until tomorrow. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and restock this with my stuff that came out of the other one. And of course, I need to let the water run, I guess, about, what, two to three gallons before we can start using the water. So I'm going to get that squared away. But yeah, so same refrigerator. I'm going to put all this stuff back in there, um, especially the stuff that goes in the freezer before that starts really thawing out. My son just got home from school. How was school today? Good. It was good. What you learn? Uh, I usually stay in there almost four because sometimes my bus take long. It's, it'd be last. Mm -hmm. And so I learned math. Like, we don't really like use, we use books, but not like all the time. And then I went, I did ULA, read it. Okay. Um, I did Epic. Epic is like, a game, it's not a game, but you can watch sports, WWE, basketball, like reading, like it read to you, or you to read by yourself. And like, um, <laughs> um, like I did, met is I have, um, actually, we do, um, snacks, snacks. We do snack. And, so yeah, snack time. Yeah, and, okay. and, and we just do the same thing. So right. wait, guys, let me see thing is hot. Chase. I got my Hawaii shirt. All Hawaii. right, all right, all Instead right. So you had a great day in school. All right, good thing. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and close out this vlog uh, with my replacement refrigerator. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Um, oh, before I go, I just wanted to like show you guys what's happening with my dishwasher. I thought I'd record this, but I didn't. Um, hold on one second. I'm gonna turn the camera. So dishwasher issues. Uh, so two things happening here. When I got the four laid, apparently the four people, they didn't add enough floor under there so it kind of got misaligned and it's just not in there right um so they have to come back and readjust that but then secondly the dishwasher just isn't functioning properly so i mean this dishwasher is like really straightforward i mean it's not that difficult um but there's something going on these lights been lit like for a week now and they haven't gone off so i know there's something malfunctioning um, with these selections. And I've called GE, so they're, we're gonna have a technician come out um, from GE to kind of assess the problem and see what's happening. And then if there's nothing that they could do, then of course I'm gonna have to get another dishwasher. So, and it's crazy because when I, before I moved into this home, I, already, I had said to myself, I'm going to make use of the dishwasher so much more than I did in my last time because I hardly use it then. And of course, I get myself in this mold, like really use my dishwasher, and boom, this happened. So hopefully when this get all fixed, I can 
get back into that same routine and using my dishwasher more. But until then, I just been washing my dishes and which I really don't want to because a dishwasher really cleans your dishes so much more. So, but that's the, that's the issue with my dishwasher. Um, so again, hopefully I can get that uh, rectified soon. All right, so thank you for tuning in to another vlog. I uh, hope you really enjoyed this one, the home updates that I have. Um, next week, next week, when I upload, I am going to have some furniture. I'm going to have my counter stools. I'm going to have a new countertop. Um, so I cannot wait to show you guys. Um, and I'm also going to have a new faucet. I'm still waiting for my hardware. It's still on back order. Hopefully that'll be coming soon uh, from the builder. But yeah, and lots of great things in store um, in the next vlog. So hopefully you tune in. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Until next time.